Hi, this is Carrie Sullivan with Eastern Oregon REN, Regional Education Network, and I will be showing you how to use the snipping tool. This is useful to copy an image off of the internet to a presentation, worksheet, or what have you. I'm just going to start here at the PowerPoint. You'll go into internet, choose an image. For this example, I'm going to add a picture of my school. So I have done a Google search for Dayville School district. I will go here and select images. When I find an image that I like, I like this image here, I'm going to go to the snippet tool. I have the snippet tool on my computer pinned to my bar, but if you don't have that, just go ahead and type to search for the snippet tool. S-N-I-P-P -P, and it just comes up, snipping tool app click on that and then go to new. As soon as you hit new, you can just use your cursor to select the image that you like and then when you release it, it'll copy it. So then you'll go to file and then edit copy. So you copy it and then go to the document that you want to insert your image. When you're ready to insert it into your document, go ahead and right click and paste. Now what you'll notice here is that you cannot see the image that I've pasted because it is behind the text box that I want to have it on top of. So we'll just go ahead and right click on that and send to back. When we do that, the picture of our school comes up and that's the Dayville school. Then if I wanted to add a picture of a map of Dayville, I would just go to the internet once again and let's say I'll choose maps and the maps should come up here in just a second. Okay, so you can see the map, but in order to see the Dayville school district with a little more context, I'm going to move this screen out to where you can see Bend because most people are pretty familiar with the Bend Redmond area as well as Baker City. So I am going to use the snipping tool again. I'm going to hit new, things reservation, select to Bend and Baker City. So that gives maybe down to Harney County as well to give people an idea of where we're located. I'll go to edit copy. I'm going to go back to my PowerPoint presentation and once again I'm going to right click and select paste. I'm going to bring this to the front then I'll just edit it a little bit so you get an idea of location. There you have it. That's how you can use Snippet Tool and my challenge to you is to try to use Snippet Tool for creating something to add visual interest to your presentations and student handouts without being limited to images preloaded on your computer. I hope this helps to give you a new tool to open doors to a world of creativity and visually appealing materials for your students. Thank you for your time. Please check back at the Eastern Oregon REN site for more professional development materials. Until next time, this is Carrie Sullivan from Dayville School.